Hello and welcome to the Steps to Maths website. In this video we're going to be having a quick look at how some of the basic skills are broken down. One of the topics that we'll be looking at in the course is equations and algebra and in this video we're going to have a look at how some of that information is broken down into the step-by-step -step skills that you need in order to get an understanding of equations and the ability to perform them. Okay, so we've gone to our website. We're going to be looking at all questions. The category we're looking at is going to be algebra, and we're going to start off with our first topic on substitution. Topic, first topic on substitution is finding the value of 6a, and there's a video that goes with this and explains what that means. It means 6 multiplied by the value that a has, which is 3. So the answer question is, what is 6 times 3 with an answer of 18? Submit that and you get your answer. Then we move on to substitution two. Slightly more difficult. It asks you for a combination of algebra and how to solve that. Then you move on to the next section. A combination of algebra but using subtraction as well. More subtraction and more algebra and more and more complicated information goes on as we go along through this. So let's have a look at equations. first topic we're looking at is addition and it's a very basic equation it's similar to what you see in junior school where there's an open box and you're asked what number do I add to 5 to get 11 the answer of course is 6 put that information in you get your answer the second topic subtraction slightly more complicated than the previous one you have to understand what subtraction is slightly more complicated again what number do I take away from 13 in order to get 7 and this process continues so that you find out about addition, about subtraction, about multiplication, about division, about combinations of multiplication and division and how to do those step by step. And that continues on to more and more difficult situations where you're asked to solve fractional equations, complex equations, um, which will arise in other topics. So that's the basis of what we're looking at here how to solve things, how to break them down into simple tasks or basic skill sets that need to be learnt in order to move on from one step to the next. As you can see, the idea behind this is fairly okay. You get the idea of this and you move on to the next step. And then in the end, you can have groups of questions and the ability to solve topics that we're going to be looking at. And as with many of the topics, there's help pages that go with that, providing information as well as video help or links to additional video help in different sections.